you're all right. I'm gonna do a video for you now. It's kind of like one of the first videos that I'll have ever have done demonstrating me using a product. So I'm a little bit nervous because I want to get it right for you and I want to make sure that I get all the information across to you as well. Because the product I'm going to show you is the one on a previous video where I unboxed and it looked really pretty on my carousel and it is easy on the eye. It's the gentle waterproof, well, it's a gentle eye makeup remover, but it's suitable for waterproof products as well. So whether that's for your brows or an eyeliner or waterproof mascara, this will get rid of it. But because of the beautiful ingredients inside it, they're all botanical ingredients, um, it's really effective, but really gentle. So for years, I used to use baby wipes to take off my eye makeup and I'd be there like scrubbing, scrubbing, and then I'd move along the wet wipe a little bit to get to a clean bit and then I'd scrub a bit more and then I'd move it around and the wet wipe would have like little black lines all around it. I don't need to do that with this product and I'm gonna show you how I use it. So the first thing that I will get is take my cotton wool pads. I have reusable pads that I have at home, but they're in the wash. So for this video, I'm gonna resort to using the cotton pads. And it's a good thing to show you because actually, when you hold your skin therapy class with me, I send you out two pads in your spa in a box. So this is what you'll get. Now, I don't use them dry on my skin. A couple of reasons for that. The first reason and the main reason for me is the skin around your eye is really delicate. It's a lot thinner than the skin on the rest of your face, so it needs a gentle touch. And with a dry cotton wool pad, you get a lot of friction, so it can drag around your eye area, and that's not a good thing. So I dampen them um, so it's a bit smoother and it glides on my skin a little bit easier. The other reason why I dampen them is because this has some lovely ingredients in it, a little goes a long way. And whether you're using a reusable pad or you're using these cotton pads, it tends to soak up a lot of product, whatever it is you're using. So a lot gets wasted actually just filling up your pad and we don't want that. So I dampen it. So when you do actually put your product on, a little goes a little bit further for you. Well, a lot further for you actually. And that's also good for um, value for money as well, isn't it? So uh, what I've got on today, is my mascara. I've got a waterproof eyeliner on as well. Um, and then I've got a little bit of eye makeup base. Uh, so that's what I'll be taking off. So, a wee bit of water from the tap. And then I'll just press it together so the water goes through both pads. And then I'm gonna put my product on. So, I'll take my lid off. I'm going to use just a couple of pumps really on each pad, but I'm gonna try and cover four. I'm gonna try and cover the whole of the pad area because I'm gonna pop them on my eyes. Now, I have a tendency to want to rub, and I think that's just years of doing that with the website actually having to rub to take off my eye makeup. But with these ingredients, you don't need to. So um, some of the ingredients that's inside this product is um, aloe vera, cornflower, um, camellia tea, and eye bright. And all of these ingredients are just geared for being an effective makeup remover, but also putting some lovely treats onto your skin. It, they're all botanical ingredients, they're natural, there's no extra perfumes that's added, there's no extra fragrances and perfumes that are added in any of the Temple Spa products actually. It's all natural, the smell that you can smell is all natural. It's fresh, it's really, really nice. So that's really great for skin, especially sensitive skin. This particular product is suitable for all skin types, um, including sensitive skin. So I've just sat the pads on my eyes for a couple of seconds. You could see that I wasn't needing to rub and already that's taken <laughs> quite a lot of it off. So I'm just gonna remove the rest, excuse me, while I'm peering into my phone. So as I say, I do have a little bit of a tendency to rub. 
which I know I shouldn't. But I rub my lashes as opposed to, to rubbing my whole eye area. And you can see that that's coming off really gently. I had my eyelashes tinted uh, not too long ago from one of my lovely friends. So my eyelashes are still quite dark. They usually have little blonde tips right on the end, which is why I wear my mascara every single day. I'm just going to double check in the mirror and make sure I've got it all. Yep, that's that one. And then we'll do this one. <clears throat> so you may have seen my previous video and I would have told you that this product is absolutely fine for you to use if you wear contact lenses. I wear contact lenses, I've got them in now. Um, if you wear false lashes, you have to be mindful of what products that you use around that because you want them to be oil free because the oil can actually take the glue off from your eyelashes and easy on the eye is oil free. So it's absolutely fine for you to use around your lashes. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, and because it is really effective and you don't need to do a lot of rubbing, it's actually ideal if you are wearing eye makeup with your eyelashes because you don't need to do a lot of work to remove your eye makeup. So I'm just gonna check that in the mirror as well. Just had a little bit, I uh, couldn't quite see because of the shadow. So that's it, done. I do have naturally red skin around my eyes. That's just my coloring, which is why I use an eye makeup base. But hopefully you can see that my eyes aren't red. They don't, the skin around it, it doesn't feel sore, it doesn't feel gritty, it doesn't feel stretched out or burnt. There's no tingling or anything. It feels fresh and it feels bright. And um, it, it actually feels quite, quite calm. The skin feels quite calm, even though I've just taken, you know, <laughs> a good couple of coats of mascara off. So, I, I love this product, I really do, and it does look really pretty in the bottle. Um, I don't send this out to everybody for hosting, if you have one of the, the skin therapy classes with me, where I send you out the spa in the box, because not everybody wears eye makeup, but if you would like to try it, let me know, because I can absolutely include this in your spa in the box, and you can try it for yourself, and hopefully you'll love it as much as I do. So there we go. I hope you enjoyed the video. Take care.